Joey, make a move already. Okay, here you go, tough guy. My fuck ogre's gonna fuck your fuck off. Hmm. Yeah, I tell ya. Like that wimpy card has a chance against my giant rock guy. Can she do that? Oh, yeah. <sighs> Once again, you lose and I rock. You stink at this game. You stink at this game, Joey. You suck. I can't win a Duel Monsters to save my life. What is it, Yugi? Why can't I ever win? Teach me what I'm doing wrong. <sighs> well, let's start by checking your dick, Joey. <laughs> hey, Grandpa, I brought you a new student. Taya beat me three games in a row. Actually, Taya beat you five times in a row, Joey. Five? I thought we were friends. I could teach you to be a great tournament duelist. Ah, please, Yugi, help me convince him. If I agree, you must work hard. I'll do anything. Mm. Fine, then we'll begin your instruction immediately, my young friend, and believe me, under my tutelage, you will learn. Uh... Good evening, Duel fans and our 10 million viewers at home, and welcome to the Duel Monsters Duel Dome. Doug Dimmodome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimmodome. Bug Boy versus Dinosaur Breath? What kind of match is that? That should have been me in there. Time for your lesson. What? We're not done? Not by a long shot, you slacker. Now quit your whining, Joseph. I know you've been working long and hard, but you really are coming along as a duelist. This package came for you. A package? What is it, Gramps? I don't know. It just came in the mail. Huh. It's from Industrial Illusions. Is it possible they heard I beat the world champion? You mean Kaiba? The package was delivered to the boy just as you ordered, sir. Excellent. Pop it in and check it out. Okay. With no monsters left on the field, I summon Dark Magician. Declare direct attack. Ah, you got me. Told Joe's the master. That's crazy. No, it's magic. <laughs> Start the clock and make your move, Pegasus. You have never faced a duelist like me before. You may be good. I assure you, I'm not. But I will beat you to save my friends. You won't save anyone with that dragon card. How? The impossible is quite possible. But what you're telling me can't be true. Real monsters. Huh? And real magic. What? The Egyptians lost control of them and nearly destroyed the entire world. What? Real monsters. Huh? Real magic. It's a good story, Pegasus, but these monsters can't be real. Tell that to my Dragon Piper. <laughs> As you see, Yugi, these monsters are very real. He's right. Time's running out, and I still haven't figured out whether he can really read my mind or if it's some kind of trick. I've never seen that before. <laughs> it's gotta have something to do with that weird eye of his. I already know you plan to play the zombie warrior. And I'm already prepared. Not this time. I figured out your little game, Pegasus. You may be able to see the cards in my hand, but you can't see the cards I pull from the deck. Hmm? My next card is... The Dark Magician! Nicely played. But by using your Dark Magician, you've let me manipulate you once again. <sighs> by playing that one card, you have ensured my victory. No. Pegasus knows all kinds of tricks, but I gotta find a way to defeat him. I just have to trust in my grandpa's cards. This card is useless. Well, Yugi, our time together is nearly up, and as I've more life points than you, it appears I am the victor. Summon Skull! Attack! I have taken the measure of your talents this day, Yugimoto. I'm done with your games. You presume I'm giving you a choice in the matter, but I'm not. That's right, Yugi boy. I have found that, given the proper incentive, anyone can be made to play my game. <gasps> Grandpa! Yes, we will duel again, Yugi. How else will you ever reclaim your grandfather's Grandpa! soul? <laughs> Grandpa! Grandpa! Subscribe! <laughs>